All right. Uh, that was a lesson, though. So, apparently, I, I've never paid close enough attention to notice it. But apparently, on Legendary Difficulty, if you kill Grimgor, he will respawn between three and four turns later. Because he died at the exact same time in the same battle as that uh, Legendary Hero I had died. And he hadn't respawned yet. And he respawns in five turns. Muck pumping these hours so he closes the gap with yours, too. <laughs> <laughs> MT says, watching units trying to chase down something gives me an aneurysm. Oh my god. Dude, I just wanted them to surround him. Warhost of Tsar claimed another seat. Oh man. Ready for duty. Gore does his backup. Nice. And lots of stuff. Convoy completed. Mountain trade. Orc Shaman. Wins a magic reserve plus one per turn. Minus cooldown to spells. Added unit Arachna Rock Spider. That's insane. That's a tier four unit for that convoy. Wow. Uh, no, the convoy does not get to keep that item. Possessed amulet. Armor of the forge. Okay, so... One second here. Orc Shaman's gonna go in that army. Magic items. Possessed amulet. Plus melee, plus armor piercing damage. I'll put that on him. And it's kind of like a better than situation. Convoy Overseer. Alright, he's already got the good ones. Let's see, sell value of cargo. Okay. Alright. This. Alright, so we can auto it. So, first, let's get everyone down there so that the auto is more in our favor. Uh, Gorda's backstabber. We're back in the army to replenish those troops. Jack cares about Mox's health. Uh, I mean, y'all let me stream every single day. I'd say there's a limit. <laughs> we be in the middle somewhere. Brunta orcs. Alright, there we go. Alright, uh, and who's gonna get plus 10% fizz resist? Quick take Jeff's money in the Oh, it's an area down. around him. Alright, we'll put it on the main man. Alright, auto. Okay. And I think I'm gonna take another outpost. More supplies. Potion of healing. Oh, that's nice. Giant wolf for Gordas. Talfon got a Taurus, and we got a piece of armor. I'm getting tugged on right now. What? Take Jeff's money, I'll hold it. Thanks, Adwan J. Says it's bedtime too. And Chip just says it's petting time. Chip and I are often awake until around two, whether I'm streaming or not. Alright. So Gorda's level. Let him have a helm of Discord. Um what do we got here? Uh bonuses for Hobbs. Bonuses for Hobbs. Dodge up melee defense missile resist. Anything here give armor piercing? I don't think so. Unfortunate. Okay. Mm. Melee defense for Hobbs and all for your units. Alright, we'll start leveling Dodge. We'll eventually put him in another army that will make better use of that. Okay, that right there. Oh, there, uh, there's one hiding over there. Uh, that and that is all that's left of Grimgor. That? Mm, don't need that right now. Okay, so do that. And what do we got? 
plus 10% ammo, all armies, and plus one hero capacity for Infernal Castellan. Martial training, hollow rounds, reload time reduction, and missile strength. Is Tomarcon on the way? Possibly. Uh, let's go ahead and get pandemic preparations. Since he might be. I don't know. As Tomarcon's right here, there is... Who is this? I think this is the, uh, the Sun Eater is right there. I don't know. Does he hate Tomarcon? The no, they're not at war right what? now. That is the Sun Eater. Okay. Oh, wait. He's in my area. Dude. I will Please leave me alone. <laughs> I, I cannot be dealing with you right now. Um, man, Grimgore does not want a PC. Even though he has one city left, he doesn't want peace. He's like, no, man, I still got this. I still got this. Uh, Alright, do that. And... Don't have a ton. Spend some supplies on that. Okay, and can't do anything at the tower yet. Need more influence. Convoy dispatch available. Uh, this one can go back out. All right, what was the last one that we did? I wish I could see the history. Is it Bay of Blades? All right, what can we do? We can put send them armaments and get back a ton of gold. I don't think we've done haunted forest yet. Castle Drag. I wonder if Castle Drakenhof would give me a regen item. And when Cathay does a trade route to Castle Drakenhof, they get a regeneration item. I don't know if this one would. I'm gonna try it. Let's see if. Uh, Drakenhof share. Oh, wait, there's another goblin there. Let's see if Drakenhof shares with me as much as they did with Cathay. Alright, Tomarcon, just get, just give me like 20 more turns. <laughs> just leave me alone in there. And Sun Eater, please don't hit me. I gotta say, uh, these guys are fine so far, the Chaos Dwarves. I really don't like the uh, just so early having to go move army, move army, move army, move army. Next turn. Move army, move army, move army, move army. Like, I had to do that in Age of Wonders. Now we're doing it here. It's just like, yeah, having all these extra lords is powerful early game, but the micro on them is annoying. And then also this area with these mountains, freaking hate it, awful. I think getting the skill that gives diplomacy bonus is really needed right now. It's diplomacy bonus with certain factions. I don't know that it's with any of the ones I'm having trouble with right now. New convoy contacts. Um, okay. Oh my god, this is the highest our health has been in years! Alright, we don't want to go through there because that would be trespassing. Uh, let's see. Alright. Can I just roll over this guy real quick? Decisive victory. Alright, boom. He's gone. Um... Take the labor, I guess. Okay, he got Talisman Preser. Ooh, 16% ward save. That is awesome. Uh, this guy can have a Talisman. Oh, wait, no. He had the possessed one. That was on purpose. Damn. Okay, so you were suggesting. Let's see, Master of the Conclaves. Well, Warriors of Chaos. Well, Tomarcon is a Warrior of Chaos. Damon's okay. Uh, hmm. I could. Let's take a look. Uh, that's an interesting idea. That's an interesting idea. So, let's go. Where's Tomarcon? No, wait, Tomarcon's not a warrior of chaos. Sorry, he's Nurgle. Uh, that. Yeah. And what's my. What's my rep with him right now? Right now it's negative 26. And. Ostrogoth, if I take this, then check it, it's still negative 26. Uh, but it is going up slowly. It is going up slowly. So, I don't know. 
That might allow us to get peace soon, but it's certainly not now. Uh, so I can pick another thing in the tower. Raw materials per turn, raw material output, di more diplomacy, more income from trade, campaign movement after winning a battle, random enchanted item, armaments cost. So 100 per turn is great, but that's kind of just like having half of an outpost. This is 50% more trade money and also diplomacy, so this scales into the later game. So I'm going to take that. And who knows, maybe it will help me. Will I, I don't know if it will help me with that or not. Alright, so Astrogoth, uh, this guy leveled up from that last battle. What is Grotesque Mutation? Causes terror. Sweet. Um... Molten core. Molten core. Alright. I don't want to trespass on this guy. It'll probably take like three turns to go around that way, though. It might be worth trespassing just to take this out. Wait. That's not Grimgore. That's Greases. Wait, 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 wait. What? Uh, Greece just took Grimgore's last city, I think. But it didn't say he died. So, Grimgore might have an army wandering around still? You dare approach me. Yeah, he's still on the diplomacy menu. I don't like what he must have, like, one army somewhere. Uh, okay. Well, Grimgore's not a problem anymore. I hit, dude, my my lands. Look at this. <laughs> Freaking impossible to defend all this. All right. Um. So the question is, do I try to go hit Greasus now, or because I can't get to Tomarcon without trespassing and making someone else mad at me? Get that. Hmm, this is a big choice. Alright, it seems like I don't want to fight the other Chaos Dwarves. Like, it, see, it feels like the game makes it really easy to not be enemies with the other Chaos Dwarves. And there's... Where is there? There's a group there. There's a group there. I'm here. That's Norska, they like me. Go to the Darklands, take out the Vamps. What? The dark... The, the vampire's over here? Or are you talking about different vamps? Like, at the, the section of the map that I'm on right now, I don't know of any vampires in this area. The ones that are your neighbors. Oh, these are vampires. Uh, I mean, they're not that close to neighbors. Uh... Or drink. Oh, I've got military access with Gorth. I can pass through his area. Alright. Yeah, I can do that. A little nervous about that? That would be getting further in front. I mean, I guess I got enemies on all sides, don't I? Yeah, they, they, they directly border you. To be fair, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine factions border me. <laughs> so that doesn't narrow it down, but I see them. I see. I assume you're talking about these guys. Lamy and Sisterhood. Uh, okay. Yeah, I can go down there. I'm just nervous of uh, Colette getting out at me. The mountain god. Hopefully he keeps uh, Tomarcon off my back. Alright, what is this, turn 20? Alright, so this is when things could start going weird. Alright, so if I want to hit this... Ugh, there's a bunch of attrition over there. Kolek should like you. Well, he's neutral, but it's going up a bit now. Wait, can I tunnel there faster? No, I can't. Okay, they're heading over. 
Yeah. Alright, we'll try that out. Darklands is good territory for you. We'll see. The ogres don't really love me, but they're not attacking me right now. So if Tomrakhan shows up over there, or if the ogres show up over there, I'm going to start losing those eastern cities. Uh, that's a leftover Grimgore hero. Still don't know where Grimgore's last army is. Tretch is going to be a problem real soon. What is Tretch? Tower of Tsar. Okay, he got the materials per turn. And we have finished this thing, so all of us get armaments and raw material upgrades. Skavens. Um, is that these guys? No, that's not right. Are they further south? Oh, they're like, they're further south, aren't they? Grimgor, Grimgor comes back with five armies, you'll see. Maybe. I mean, as long as I still see this hero, his lord, he's got a guy somewhere. Not sure where he is, though. Alright, if I tunnel, there's no attrition, right? Uh, wait a minute. I'm in ally territory. Why are we not getting replenishment? This army's in foreign territory. Oh, it's because we don't have a defensive alliance yet. Oh my god. So I'm allowed to pass through here, but I don't get healed. So I might need to spend a turn in encampment. Okay, there's that. Alright, research. Brazen Bodyguard, can get another hero thing. Can get a Daemon Sorcerer. I still don't have any of those. I'll do that, just get one for the main army. And let's see, Convoy Overseer, Wayfinders. And I wanna build any of this stuff. I can build, actually let's uh, build at the, the area that I completely own, just it's a little bit safer. Okay. You could do the quest battle. Um, I had a few units at half health. I don't know if I could do it yet. I might be able to do it now. And then in camp move forward. Did that hero vanish? I'm wondering if Grimgore's last army just got wiped out by uh, Greasus. That would that would be great if that happened. It would be bad if Grimgore suddenly showed back up hitting a city. Convoy encounters Ogre Mercenaries. Spend 1,000 gold to add a man-eater to this convoy. Or just say get lost and continue the journey. I'll take it. Faction destroyed, Grimgore. Nice. Alright. Let's... Look at that uh, advice someone just gave. So... No, this is the wrong thing. The Black Hammer of Hashut. In the following battle with Astrogoth Iron Hand's army. It says close defeat. Alright. Most of our stuff is full health now. Let's try it out. Alright, Kraito. Trying it out. Trying it out. That's a weird map, isn't it? Just hope I can set up my uh, my cannon this time. I didn't get to use it last time very well. And we do have three blunderbusses now, because I got the Regiment of Renown blunderbuss. The fools in Tsar Nagrund, I th think to unmake my majesty, and so my legions will ensure the safety of this convoy. Have the thralls loaded up, prepare to leave. You have to protect trains. What? It's an escort quest? What the hell? Enemies are close. I can feel it as much as the stone dust in my blood. Oh, boy. If I had more centaurs, it would have been better for this. Once the convoy reaches the clearing, no enemy will dare to attack us, and victory will be mine. 
Uh, huh. Soon, good song, Doc. All right. This is really weird. This is really weird. Uh, it's like this whole army excels at sitting in one spot. Uh, Do my best, but this is weird. I'm wondering if I should even keep the cannon with me or not. We'll see. I saved it beforehand. And I've never done this mission before. Go Trikes and Felix Quest isn't hard. Oh, I've done the Go Trikes and Felix Quest. Uh, when I played the, uh, what was it, like the Key Sled tutorial? I did that one. That wasn't too bad. I, I, uh, yeah, yeah, it wasn't just Unga Bunga, but I got it done. They, yeah, they live a really long time. Like, they both have self heal. Oh, 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 hang on. Those guys shattered really fast. Okay, let's get ready to move forward again. Okay, uh, that's done. That wasn't too bad. All right, speed it up a bit again. Does the train just move when you move? Or no, no, it's different from that. Um, oh boy, what is that? You are so stupid. This guy is stuck on the train. He's just running into the train. He's like, man, there's nothing I can do. Morning, oh, morning, Archie. Wow, this tank has taken more damage than I would expect it to so far. Get. 
Alright, speed it up. I like the range units. Uh, that's not really how they excel. You're using them like range units? How the Skullcrackers go into melee? These aren't Skullcrackers. I'm using these like range units because they're range units. <laughs> I'm using the Skullcrackers wrong. I don't have Skullcrackers! I do know that these have bonuses to charge, though, so I could probably be making use of them. Us too. Trying to save my cannon back here. Are you serious? They're stuck on the train again. These centaurs have the IQ of a bean burrito. Get off the train. This isn't that complicated. attack from dead ahead or from behind me. I'm sure we're gonna get hit again. From all sides. Is this the edge? Of the ah, the pipe. God, dude, they're getting stuck on everything on this map. Alright, 
guys over here stalling for time. Hello Gollum, have you met Booty? I do want to make sure these Chaos Orbs live if possible. Uh, I can't get the mode too. I can't select them. Are they in uh, rampage? Okay, got that. Uh, did our cannon get out of there? Yes, he did. Nice. It's the mass on this thing should be big, five thousand. Seconds, you got this, huh? Oh, I didn't notice the timer in the top right I, or the top left until you pointed that out. I was just trying to win. Okay, I have definitely across all the campaigns and quest battles I've done so far. I don't think I've ever done an escort quest. That was new. That was new. You did win. Well, you know, I was trying to win through normal rules. I, I thought I had to kill every enemy or break shatter every enemy. Ugh. That was a, a bit of micro. This might be the only one. Oh, yeah. Do all the Chaos Dwarves have that quest or just uh, Mr. Robot Legs? 2% replenishment is not a lot. Uh, 1800 gold. That's I think. What's the IQ of a bean burrito? <laughs> Low. <laughs> Infernal Iron Sworn, Regiment of Renown. Quest successful. You get the Black Hammer of Hashunt, 75 Conclave, and some casualty replenishment. Conclave is nice. Weapon gained. Tower of Czar. Okay, hold on. What is this weapon? Plus control everywhere. Nice. 15% weapon strength. Black Hammer of Hashut. Imbuement flammable. Okay, it's a DPS boost. Okay, it, it, uh, it buffs his damage. Alright. Um... Wait, what the hell? Oh, that's what he had equipped before. Uh, I guess he can have that. We have him meleeing a lot time. I know, I know. It's It's been five minutes, possibly even six. I know. Uh, Alright, do that, and then Arcane Conduit. And... Piercing Shots. Bandolier. Punish Troops. What is this? Faded. A uh, bunch of stuff related to hero action chance. Make some sneaky. Okay. Faded lucky. Alright. 
Now, if I want to be approaching those vampires and still getting health back from the, that battle, we need to do it in encampment stance. Also, there's the issue with the attrition in their area. So the others can tunnel over. She's like, uh, sir, sir, uh, sir, hello, you're trespassing with like, uh, 40 units. Sir, sir, what's going on? New unit. Uh, oh yeah, I, I can't, I'm in enemy territory, so I can't do that here. All right, what is this? Giant conveyor can be leveled up. Uh, let's see, give us... All right, so it already gave 500 gold a turn. That's not changing. It gives 100 more raw materials. That's a lot of investment for more raw materials. Wait, efficiency is below 100. There. Okay. How nice of them to have that thing at the top of the screen to let me know. Okay. How much is it? It's a 2,000 to upgrade that. Uh, maybe we just upgrade... Where's the other city? Karak Varag. Let's upgrade that one. Uh, let's see. Where am I? I'm here. Alright, so... Oh, they just lost this, this to Drippin' Fangs. So I think this vamp faction might just be these two things now. Okay. All right. Um, Iron Daemons. So we've tried out the Iron Daemons. They're okay. Well, I got. I will admit the um, when I saw that it had fire while moving, I was wondering is it going to be a straight ahead or in any direction, like a rotating turret or something? Because, uh, like for example, there's like uh, some of the dinosaurs that have like archers on their back have fire while moving, but what it is is the dinosaurs just attacking whatever, and the archers are hitting anything around them. So, definitely dislike the fact that they're locked to only fire forward. Uh, that definitely limits it a little bit. And I now know I need to basically be using them kind of like cavalry. A big slow chariot? Yeah. I need to basically be using them like cavalry. So, just it, when they shoot, they shoot fine. But other than that, just have them charge around. Um, I guess one nice thing about them versus normal cavalry is 5,000 mass. They can, uh, they can push through things and not get stuck which is an issue that happens with cavalry, if you are not careful. Uh, let's see, this is 100 more workload for 100 more mass. I'm not sure if I can do that right now. Okay. Uh, oh, that's right, we gotta make a choice here. Um, so this is unlocked, right? So it's 150 for this, which I'm at 115. Minus construction time for all buildings, that is pretty big. Conclave influence gain plus one per turn for factory settlement buildings. Uh, maximum convoy cargo capacity plus 10%. Hmm. Or 75 plus campaign movement after winning a battle, but that's only for the leading army. A random enchanted item every three turns. Armaments cost minus 10% for all unit capacity upgrades. I think I save my points for a tier two thing. I think I save for a tier 2 thing. Outpost available for Chaos Dwarfs, if I want to get Chaos Dwarf stuff from the Chaos Dwarfs. Uh, I've got 11,000 gold. Yeah, I, mean, I guess I can do that. Um, what's their safest place? Probably Vale of Woe. Alright, construct an outpost there. Alright. Alright, and it is 1am. We are going to save it here and eagerly continue our experiments next time.